Time for the champion hurdle now then, the premier hurdle race of the meeting. Let's take a look at the field. Two miles and a half a furlong. Grade one, of course, at the top. Arnold School for David Robertson. Building Bridges, Joshua Sutherland, Constitution Hill. David Hooley, Ikarudu, Song, James Shea, San Pedro Dreams for Vinnie Girard, St. Nicholas at Wade, Darren Thompson, State Man, David Hooley, Vive La France, the favourite for Daniel French, Volcanic Impact, Leon Van Rensburg, Warmonger, Joshua Sutherland, Doom River, Leon Van Rensburg, Gem Thief, Craig Beckwith, and a little Rock Liberty for Vinnie Gerard. A field of 13 then called in and away in the champion hurdle. Can Darren Thompson make it four out of four? Well, at the moment, St. Nicholas at Wade is the back marker, but I don't think you'll be too concerned about that this early on. As they head towards the first of eight flights. And it doesn't look like anything is going to take the race by the scruff of the neck and go off into an early lead as they get to the first of the eight. And there was nearly a fall at the first there. And it was Constitution Hill, I think, who very nearly went right at the beginning of the race. But it's Arnold School who's now gone into the lead as they head up the straight towards the fence with the flight should I say the flight of hurdles it'll be the final flight on the next circuit and our old school for David Robertson is in the lead from Little Rock Liberty in the green just about second then Doom River and Building Bridges State Man the first of the purple jacketed pair is next as they take the second of the eight Ooh, safely over that one all jumped it okay and there that's the winning post there you can see and they head out onto the Back part of the track. And Arnold School is clear in the lead. There's a cross fence, but there's not a cross flight. So it's Arnold School that's the leader. Leading by a good six or seven lengths now to Little Rock Liberty in second. Building Bridges is next, then Warmonger. Doom Rivers after that one, then Constitution Hill and State Man. Vive la France on the inside. Ikarudu Song is next, and Nicholas at Wade. He's getting a bit closer. San Pedro Dreams as they get over the third flight. The back marker is just Gem Thief. A lot of people fancy a lively outsider for this one, but it's Arnold School who's in the lead. Leading by five lengths or so to Building Bridges and Warmonger. And State Man, who's more lightly raced than the rest of them, in the inside in fourth. Little Rock Liberty is next. Then Doom River, Vive La France. It's probably just about got the best form. Then Ikarudu Song as they get over the fourth of the eight. Good jump on the inside that time by Constitution Hill as we change angles and see them racing into the final seven furlongs. And Arnold School is the leader by about three lengths to State Man and Doom River are sharing second. And Vive La France on the inside of Warmonger. Little Rock Liberty is next. Building Bridges come around the outside. Then Constitution Hill. One who's struggling out the back now is Ikarudu. Some volcanic impact has got work to do. And so too is St. Nicholas at Wade if he's going to give Darren Thompson a four-timer. But it's Arnold School who leads by two lengths to Vive La France in second. Doom River is third. Warmonger. Then Constitution Hill and State Man trying to come through now. Little Rock Liberty. Building Bridges is still there as well. Volcanic impact is running off of the back. St. Nicholas at Wade got nowhere to go boxed in and on the outside Jim Thief is flying over the third last they go just the two to take in the straight now and Arnold School is still in the lead then Leon Van Rensburg pair are closing Doom River and Volcanic Impact Vive La France on the inside State Man after that one then Little Rock Liberty Warmonger building Bridges and Nicholas away there over the second last then after that Constitution Hill they're racing towards the home turn now in the final flight and it's Volcanic impact on this near side has come to challenge for the lead. State Man is there as well. So is Arnold School, Doom River, Little Rock Liberty as they come down to this final float. Vive La France is a bit short of room over the final float they go. And it's Arnold School who's back in the lead again. Here comes Vive La France. Arnold School and Vive La France is going to be close. Arnold School has won. Arnold School has won it for David Robertson. Maybe a bit of a surprise, a bit of an upset. Arnold School, the long time leader. I think Vive La France may be an unlucky loser. Couldn't get a run early. It's close for third between the Hooli Bear and Volcanic Impact. And Arnold score for David Robertson. A bit of a surprise winner at 50 to 1 for David Robertson. Vive La France for Daniel French was an unlucky second, I think. A six year old running a big race. Third was Volcanic Impact for Leon Van Rensburg. David Hooli was fourth and fifth with Constitution Hill and State Man. So no four-timer for Darren Thompson, but a 50-to-1 turn-up 
in the champion hurdle.